Hey, hey, hey. Let me turn that music down. Welcome. Happy drop Welcome. day. Hey, hey. hey. Good, good. Uh, everybody who is here in the chat, come say hello so we can say hi back to you. I am very pleased to welcome Horsky. I said that right. Whiskey. Yeah, <laughs> Sounds like whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> welcome. Um, happy to have you. Can you tell us a little bit about uh, FSOE and your involvement? Because we are really happy to be kicking this off today. No, it's fine. Yeah, well, first of all, nice to meet you, Lisa. Thanks very much for having me. Um, yeah, my name is Perisky. I'm an Irish uh, DJ and producer. Um, I've been involved now with FSOE and UV for maybe just over a year, a tad more. But um, I've been a big fan of FSOE for a long, long time. Um, being from Ireland, trance is kind of it's kind of a bloodline in Ireland. And you know, once you grow up, yeah, everybody is into trance at some stage. Um, so I've obviously been a big fan and. I was a big fan of Ali and Fila, and it's just a natural progression to get here. So to be here now representing them and chatting to yourself about this uh, NFT drop, it's, it's great. That's great. I just see uh, Reliquary in the comments here. He is, I think, one of our biggest trance fans, so he's going to be really excited to listen to some of the music today. guys. <laughs> yeah. So um, what can you let us know about FSOE for our uh, our players here who might not be so familiar and this might be their first time? What are what excites you about being involved with Future Sound of Egypt? Well, well it's, it's it's a couple of things. Obviously, like FSOE is the like there's trance, and um, but they also have the label UV, which is run by Paul Thomas, which I'm kind of more involved. It's more progressive, and. Um, and I think for, for that reason, you're, you're kind of getting best of both worlds. So you're getting some trance, you're getting some progressive. And I just think trance and progressive kind of go hand in hand too. Um, I don't know many trance people that don't love a bit of progressive. And I think it's, it's the same the way around with progressive, love a bit of trance too. Totally. Love it. And you've got a couple of tracks in this drop. I'm just looking at it now. We've got Feel the Fire. Shadow Chaser, and I wonder if there's something on your artist card too. Let me look that up. Um, tell us about the process of choosing what tracks you wanted to drop as an NFT. Is this, wait, is this your first NFT? This is my first NFT, yeah. First nice. ever. First <laughs> ever, yeah. Um, it's, a, it's, a, it's a massive, it's a massive pause. It's, it's obviously a massive privilege as well. Um, I, think it's, I think it's a great idea going forward for, for artists and also just for, for like fans or, or collectors or anything because it's a it's a really cool way of collecting music now um not just having a digital copy or having a cd it's 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 a more of a collectible item um but i i just obviously paul gave me the chance and we, we had a little chat about what songs and we, we've kind of come up with a go few tracks and i'm sure there'll be more packs down the line too but uh for this one we went with uh i done a special nft edit of whispers which was a track of mine that was out in October, um, and that should be in it too. And then we have Shadow Chaser and also um, Fuel the Fire, as you said. Okay, let me bring up and show off some of these cards. I have to admit, I love um, the design that's coming along with this one. Let me share my screen. I shared, I just stopped it. Whoops. All right, well, here's your artist card. Love awesome. it. <laughs> how gotta ask how is it weird to see well i mean you're probably used to it at this point but is it weird to see kind of the new different technologies is coming up and how they look and feel different um uh, it's completely, how yeah like obviously I, I've, obviously i see the pictures of myself kind of most days on social media but it, it's really cool to see it laid out like this and for it to be such a it's an exciting thing to be happening too Nice. Um, JC Denton, good morning. It's <laughs> not morning for me and it's uh, pretty getting a little late for our friend here, yeah. uh, but good morning. Um, and Amir just asked if we can clarify what NFTs are. And I would love to do that in the next few minutes before the drop starts. So you're actually looking at an NFT on the screen right now. Um, this we call an artist card. The way I like to think about NFTs NFTs um, as a whole, and maybe not just this one in particular, is it's very similar to a vinyl, um, like a, a record or a CD. 
just in digital format. And when I think about it, so I could go and buy um, the future sound of Egypt that well, maybe not today. I couldn't buy a record of it, <laughs> but in, in the good old days, uh, you could go and buy a record. And part of the reason you would want to do that is one, to support the artist you really love, two, to have that music. You know, it wasn't as accessible. Um, but some of the downsides, and maybe uh, Horsky, you can speak to that and uh, how difficult it is to make a, a living wage with Spotify. And, you know, you're making yeah, fractions it's, it's, of a it's, penny. Yeah, it's massively hard. Um, the one thing I will say is, like, you don't really get into music to make much money because you won't stay in it for long. But thankfully, we're kind of in it for a love with and, and and the buzz of making stuff. But obviously, you get to a stage where you, you obviously do need to make some sort of money. And um, it's extremely hard with streaming and stuff. Um, even with like with B-port and stuff, like you know, it, it's you, you don't get that much of a cut. And um, even with, like some labels won't get much of a cut. But like the, the likes of I think streaming with Spotify. I think for like a thousand plays, you might get five euros, which has to be split as well. So I think with NFTs, it gives artists more of a chance that we, we can make our art and then hopefully make a small bit more of a living off it. And I, I mean, like Air NFTs, the FSOE, FSOE NFTs, it's only like nine dollars too. So it's not as if we're asking for loads and loads of money either. Yeah. That's uh, excellent. Thank you very much. That was a great uh, explanation, <laughs> considering you were saying you're not the super um, in touch, but I really appreciate that. And I think you touched on a great thing is that, let me share this screen. Uh, why am I not able to share very easily? Uh, I'm Okay, well, this is annoying, but I'll be doing this today, I guess. <laughs> So let's go and actually check out the pack. So when you buy one of these NFTs, you're actually buying a pack and in the pack you get three NFTs. Um, so it looks exactly like that. Oh, I did not share my screen after I did all that work. Um, <laughs> so in about five minutes, they're gonna come available and there's three NFTs. Uh, they all contain, well, most of them contain music. They all, oh, great. He says, totally makes sense. Appreciate that. Um, but I, I really like this. Hi, Sonia. Um, you know, and I was just telling Horsky uh, while we were chatting before this, I actually started as a user and, and everybody who's been here for a while has heard this story a million times, but I started with Record Shop as a, a player, a collector, and I really fell in love with the concept and everything you just said about artists really struggling to do something that they love and be able to actually focus time on it while also, you know, living a comfortable life. Yeah. Um, yeah. And I don't know. I think this is just an op a, a foot in the door of something that can be totally changing. I, like to me, I don't see NFTs ever going away. Um, this is the next, the next takeover of how we consume music and how we connect with artists which I think is the most exciting part. And we'll talk about some of the challenges that are associated specifically with um, FSOE, but also we can talk about some of the other things that we've done to connect fans and artists and how NFTs can facilitate that. Um, I'm going to just trade up some of our view here. There we go. So uh, that's one thing we really love. Uh, Amir, I think I saw you in our Discord. If I'm not mistaken or maybe not maybe that was someone else we're getting we're getting some new friends and faces in which is great but um, discord is a nice chat room that we uh have set up and a great place to connect with our artists oh great okay i think that might be you uh ntc because it was nice to see some new it's nice to see some new faces in and hello leah and hello sonia um so yeah, ask, ask our team there. Uh, everybody with the green names in Discord, there are community mods. Um, everybody with the red names are staff and yellow names are artists. And we've got Ali and Fila in there too. I know they're going to be chatting up uh, and talking with everyone as this drop kicks off in only two minutes. Happy days. Yeah, yeah. Very exciting. Um, okay, actually, let's go and maybe take a peek at... Are any of your songs only two minutes? That might be a stretch. 
Let me get up something that we can let's take a peek at. Oh, I did see you set a video on your one card. How is it making that video? How is it just getting all the content ready to go for for this drop? It was it, it was kind of tough. Um, it, it's not something I'm used to, obviously talking to a camera and stuff. But obviously, I've had to get used to it over the last while. But it's fun, Lisa. Like it, it's it's um it's a bit of crack. Yeah. Um, hey. Yeah. yeah it's so basically, same, same, <laughs> same background. Um. But yeah, no, it, it was really fun. It was enjoyable, and it's you have to move with the times, especially in music and 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 being an artist and being. Um, it, around today, it, it's it's a lot to do with social media and being um people getting to getting to know you and to know the person you are as well, along with the music. So it's a it's it's been cool kind of getting to know all this stuff. Yeah, I think you know as much as the pandemic was terrible and um I wouldn't have wanted that to happen. I think it's really changed how we can connect with each other. Um, it's really opened up some doors to changing our relationships with fans and artists, which I'm really excited for because now we can like touring was put on pause for a while and everybody got to focus on their music yeah. and yeah. yeah. Um, so now we can really focus. I think NFTs are now the key to focusing on building like me as a fan. I can build a collection and say, OK, I love future sound of Egypt, I'm getting to meet uh, Horisky and like really start to engage. And then you get to yeah. say, oh, cool. Lisa actually has all of my cards. Maybe I'm going to reach out and connect with her and see yeah. if like, you know, what whatever makes sense. Um, <laughs> and Amir is saying that they're looking forward to some bookings and touring soon. I agree. <laughs> Uh, all right. Well, let's head back over to the drop page because I think it has gone live. I am really struggling with sharing my screen today. Usually I can just like flip between them, <laughs> which is why up. I'm. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, um, where? All right. Well, let me head there and then I can change my tab. All right, the drop is live. So if you head over to app.recordshop.com, right on the front page there, you'll see that the FSOE drop is live. Uh, did I forget to actually share my screen again? Of course I did. There we go. <laughs> it's live now. I'm gonna actually open up some packs. I got some, whoop, whoop. time to buy some packs. So this is your chance to get in uh, very limited editions. You guys have only minted uh, minting in NFT world just means creating. Um, and that's how many is available. Uh, but there's only 2,222 packs. <laughs> two, 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 two. Um, so let's go and check out what that looks like. So you can see kind of what you can expect to get out of it. I've got two right here. I'm going to give away what is in these packs actually let me pop the link for you to fill out so you can get in on these giveaways let me pop that in here so just fill out that form you put in your um, name that will show on stream and put in your email address that is your record shop account and then i'll drop you some free stuff uh if you are one of our winners after this stream today all right, so lots of information on this page. I'm going to open this up. And uh, and also, I love the, like, <laughs> I love the design on this pack. Really cool. I have to. It's so cool. So, so cool. Very golden. All right, let's open it up. <laughs> Leah is loving it in the comments. It is like gold. All right, so the first collectible, so if you saw there that I had three collectibles on screen. Um, they're kind of flipped and you get to open and experience each one for the first time with me right now. Uh, so this is Shadow, Paul Thomas Chill Mix. I was just talking with Paul earlier today. He is so excited. Uh, and I, I think we're gonna do some more stuff with him maybe next week. Um, but 
this song. I know he was really excited to have it included. And have you been uh, working with Paul for a while? Yeah, we've been working together since um, it was actually the 9th of January last year. I was the first time we actually sent him any, any music and we kind of, Paul's been great. He's been, he's been a great help for me to, for the last year and a half. He's been really supportive and um, I remixed one of his tracks um, back, it was out in February um, and it's done really well. I remixed one of his tracks, Mr. L, so and I think hopefully there could be some sort of work going on now in later in the year as well. Very cool. Love it. Um, okay, wait, can you, because I've seen now a couple times and for, I'm not super familiar with the FSOE brand, but I have noticed this UV yeah, uh, so that's, label that's at a couple places. Yeah, so that's the progressive label. Um, I mentioned here earlier on about I'm kind of more UV than I am FSOE, but FSOE gotcha. is like the is, is the main brand, and then UV is um is, is basically a sub label. Of nice. It. So that's all progressive, and it's a lot more um, progressive with tracks and a bit deeper and stuff. Uh, Carlos is saying he's having some problems with buying. Uh, I. No, we've got a couple of our staff on this stream right now. If you guys wouldn't mind checking that out for us, I would appreciate it. Last Chance Ranch is also having a problem. Uh, let me just... Uh, I think, can somebody, one of our team members, just like give me the heads up that they've got that one? Are they going to take that with the rest of the team? Huh. Nice. Yeah, this is really cool. I love, just really like all of the design here. Yeah, the artwork's pretty cool. All right, I just let uh, our team know about your issues. Uh, Carlos, last chance, Amir. Um, one thing I do want to quickly point out for those who are new to NFTs and something that might, uh, you might miss as your first time. Um, but it's kind of fun. There's serial numbers attached which, with each of these cards and to think of a serial number, basically when we mint these cards and again, minting just means creating, um, we serial each of them from one to however many have been minted. So I can see here 550 have been minted. Um, I kind of like this serial number, 499. Uh, it's almost 500. I like that. Um, so that's just something to keep an eye out. A lot of our community really loves to collect the like number one, uh, number 550. Everybody really likes to collect kind of like the top and the bottom. Um, and then there's always like the silly numbers that everyone likes, like 420 and 69. And <laughs> <laughs> So just something to keep an eye out. Oh, and I like how I got 488 and 499. I like that. Ooh, Leah said she got a number five. Excellent. All right, and this is a pickup artist. So um, this is not an FSOE collectible. This is actually a record shop collectible. Um, we call these artifacts. And you'll see these throughout our site when you go to our marketplace. Um, oh, great. I'm glad you guys are completing the form for the free NFTs. Awesome to hear that. Um, sorry, the form <laughs> is not for the free NFTs. I got so many things going on. Uh, the form is for some prizes, some giveaways that we're going to be doing towards the end of this. So uh, excited for that. Um, and then these artifacts here, they've got some really cool designs and vary from being very silly like this one to a little more serious, but these are really fun just when you see those. So you know what you're looking at. All right, let's open my other one. I'm actually going to give away these cards as well when we do our draw. So let me get just right down which ones they are. So I remember shadow. Um, do you know how I, how to pronounce this? Native Bay? I don't, to be honest, no. Is it not a way? Not a way? Yep. I'm going to go with that. <laughs> yeah, yeah we, just, we can blame me if it's wrong. It's okay. <laughs> I am like, oh, I feel like I'm always, 
when I'm on these streams and I'm there's a word that I'm just like, uh oh, I don't know when I'm gonna say this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Leah says that there's a greenish glow on the pack. Let me see. Let's look. Oh, right in the line. Ooh. Yeah. Is there a mummy going to come out? <laughs> <laughs> I like that. That's really cool. All right. So we're going to open this one up. <laughs> Astral Fusion on the comment says she's very excited for more trance. And Ocean, thank you very much for hosting and sharing. All right. So we got three more cards. I'm going to do something crazy. I always. <gasps> hey. hey! <laughs> Yay. Okay. We'll listen to this one um, after I'm done opening up. Uh, but why don't you tell us a little bit about creating this track and maybe what, what inspired you with this? Yeah. So uh, this track just came about completely by chance with, um, Jeremiah McKnight, who is the, the other collaborator on this, he's actually the vocalist as well. Um, me and Jerry got chatting just through social media, um, just through kind of admiration for each other's music. Um, and we, we've actually become quite good friends now at this stage. But uh, this is the first track we've done together. Um, and it, it's a track I'm, I'm actually really, really proud of. And I know Jerry is too. Um, it started out just quite a basic baseline, kick drums and percussion, um, and we, we walked through the scenes. Jerry wrote the lyrics, and basically, yeah, the rest is kind of history, I suppose. Excellent. Okay, I'm excited to listen to this after. Oh, and there's another track on it, too. Shadow Chaser. Yeah, that's that's, that's one of my own. That's my own one. Awesome. Ooh, tell us, well, tell us a little bit about it. Well, yeah, that's, it's, it's kind of more of a, a lot of trance elements in it. A lot of you can you can really tell I'm inspired with trance from Shadow Chaser. Um, it's kind of a hands in the air breakdown, and um, a lot of scenes going on. And uh, it's it's another track that I really love it. Love it uh, from myself as well. No, I love that. Okay, great. Um, okay, we'll definitely listen to this. Uh, right after we're done opening. Ooh, okay. This FSOE collector's co card. <laughs> collector's collectible um <laughs> uh it's an hour of music um thank you reliquary he says that the purchasing should be working again uh there we go so this is an hour of music that i'm pretty sure was mixed by ali and fila this is really fun to get that uh let's see plucked yesterday White rooms, love sick, love it. Yeah, some great tracks on be, there. Yeah, this will be good. Okay, this is what I'm gonna put on after the stream today because I gotta do some other like <laughs> just heads down work. Gonna get myself very focused. I'm ready. <laughs> all right, last one for me. All about the melody. Ali and Fila, excellent. Ooh, and another one with two songs on it. Awesome, awesome. So actually, while we're talking about Ali and Fila, let me just write that down for a giveaway later. All about Melody before. All right, let me, um, I do want to talk about the challenges. Speaking of Ali and Fila, we're going to do a challenge for the next, oh, it's going to be open for the next three weeks. So let's actually come take a peek at it. Just so I get everything right. So it's a collection reward. It's collecting all of the common cards from the set. So you don't have to collect. There's one rare card and there's only like 20 or so of those minted. So it'd be really hard to collect that one. Um, so if you collect all of the common cards in this Future Sound of Egypt set, uh, you are going to be um, invited to a private Zoom session with Ali and Fila, which is really exciting. Um, that's going to be a really cool session. Uh, you'll also be entered into a drop to win one of 20 posters that are signed by Ali and Fila. So I'm also very excited for that. Um, and finally, there is a grand prize where FSOE is giving away uh two VIP guest list tickets to uh, one winner. Um, you just have to complete the form to, to opt in. 
Um, that will be on September 3rd in Los Angeles uh, at the Hollywood Palladium. Uh, Horsky, have you been to FSOELA in the past? Um, well, I, I'm I assuming. I haven't. It's, it's, it's on the booking list for sure. Um, yeah, it's, yeah, it's definitely on the booking list. What a day that'll be. Yeah, that's awesome. So you're go. You are. Are you on the uh, list for this year? <laughs> Not no, sadly. So maybe, <laughs> hopefully, I, hopefully they're watching this. They might put me on it after this, maybe. <laughs> yeah, guys, we have to. We got, all right. Everybody who's in here, we gotta pump up our ski. So, yeah. it, all we can so that he can get on the list and then we can uh whoever our winner is can get a selfie with him yeah, and I, but... I, I do me greets all day no problem there <laughs> perfect <laughs> <laughs> love it love it so um right at the bottom of the challenge there's links to all of those collectibles in case you don't get them in your packs um but it's it's all of the common ones there's one rare card that only 24 are available which is ali and fila so you don't have to collect that one because that would make that would just be really difficult. Excellent. I want to see if anybody has any questions. Ooh, Amir says that all about the melody is the their favorite all time track of Ali and Fila. Um, so Amir, where can you find all of this? So the challenges is on the record shop website under challenges, uh, and then for the drops. I think I showed you how to buy that right here. And if you do want, like if you buy a couple of, uh, of the packs and you're not able to finish your collection um, just with the packs, because maybe you didn't get lucky with how they were randomized, um, there's links here. These won't be in the marketplace. It takes usually about 24 hours because we want to make sure that um, folks can get their packs first. So in about 24 hours, these cards will probably start to be available in the marketplace. But like I said, let me actually pop the link in again for the giveaway. There you go. So you might, you have a chance to win them. All right, next up, I want to listen to Feel the Fire. Whoop, that is not the thing I wanted to copy paste. There we go. All right, folks, I'm going to pause my background music and take a listen here. So one of the really great features of Record Shop is you can actually play the music. You can also download it and add it to your own um, your own player if you're listening on Sp uh, not Spotify, but Apple or um, iTunes. So you can download it and add it right into your own playlist. But let's play it from the site. Oh, no. Can you hear it? Yeah. I can't hear it. My audio is just in the wrong place. Can you still hear it? Yeah, yeah, spot on. So while that music's playing, uh, Amir is just asking if I can show how to log in. So I'm just going to do that. Uh, I can't log all the way out. Well, I'll do that right after this, actually.
feel and let it carry you Use all the pain that you feel it carries by you Don't keep hold of your fears they can't define you Use all you can from within and let it shine Oh, can you hear us okay? Yeah, my sound was on a little bit funny. Yeah, we're getting a little bit of weird uh, feedback right now. Yeah, okay. I thought it was just mine. <laughs> yeah, I had to mute you while uh, the track was playing because it was. I could see you were fiddling around with some stuff, but no worries. Everybody was loving that track. <laughs> just looking through the comments now. Everybody loves the bass line, the drop. Astro Fusion said it was beautiful, which it really was. Thank you very much. Um, oh, and Obi Fernandez has joined us. Hello, Obi. And yeah, Leah loved it too. Love it. Um, I did see some questions from Amir just on how to use the website. Um, it is a little bit new if you are new to Record Shop and you're new to NFTs. Uh, I wouldn't mind showing you around a little. I do a regular uh, Record Shop 101 stream. Uh, I'm trying to remember if I have one scheduled for next week or if it's the following week. Uh, I do have one scheduled next week. So we'll do that. Um, our famine discord is also super, super helpful. Uh, so don't be afraid to ask questions. Everybody can help you out there. All right. 
Um, any other, I, I would love to hear from the audience if there are any other tracks that you would like to hear. Maybe I can throw up um, kind of what was in the pack. Let me bring that up now just so we can take a peek. So uh, on our blog, we uh, for each drop, we do outline what to expect from the drop. Um, so you can come in here and see. And right at the bottom of these blog posts, we have here, uh, hard to see, maybe if I zoom in, there we go. Kind of, this is just an outline of every single card that's in the drop, um, if they're common, if they're rare, and how many, remember when we were talking about serial numbers earlier, so it tells you how many are being minted of each of these cards. Like I said, if we look at this Ali and Fila card, uh, only 24 are being minted. So that you can tell is super rare. If you get that, we'd love to hear if you got that. Actually, I should check Discord and see. Well, I see Ali and Fila is actually in our Discord chatting there now. So um, not to draw your attention somewhere else, stay here. <laughs> <laughs> but um, maybe once we wrap up here, hopefully they'll stick around in there. Uh, I think it's Fadi who's there. That's really, really exciting. Um, yeah, we're loving the design. I'd love to see if somebody gets that rare uh, artist card by Ali and Fila. Why don't we go take a peek at it? Um, I have the secret power so we can see it even though I don't own it. If you give me one whole moment here, I can bring it up. Let's check it out. <laughs> Leah is saying a lol uh, with my secret powers, I think. So beautiful card. I'm loving, I love, like, like I've already talked about the design, I think. <laughs> but yeah, you guys did a really great job on coming up with some really awesome content. And um, it's just really nice to learn more, um, you know, even for your fans who, like Amir, who's here, who's clearly one of, a very big fan. Um, I don't know. I, I'd be curious, Amir, what do you think of the NFTs and kind of just getting to own music in a new way that we haven't seen in a long time? Oh, and actually, Amir, since you said that this is one of your favorite tracks, I don't, I'll play it. Maybe I'll put it down in the background and we can uh, just listen to it a little bit quietly. If I can hit play right now, it's not seeming to want to play ball. How about I add to playlist and do it that way? <laughs> so I'll just put it on nice and quiet. Everybody can still hear me okay? Yep. Great. So have you been able to get out and do any, um, do any touring for yourself or getting to play anywhere? Yeah, um, I, was, I was actually only playing on Sunday night, just gone. Um, I played an international gig, I played in Belfast, um, supporting Genix. So that, that was pretty cool. And then I had a, a support a support show about maybe four weeks ago, supporting Boris Brecker as well. So there's a good few planned throughout the summer and stuff. But uh, I'm just uh, I feel really lucky and really, really happy to be able to get out and start playing shows again. Love it. Um, and you've got something dropping tomorrow as well. I do, I do indeed, yeah. Um, I have a track called Fire On Me. It's dropping tomorrow. It's featuring um, a vocalist called Summer Moreland, who is, um, she's only 17, but she's she's an incredible vocalist and massive talent. Um, and I'm really, really excited about it. It's getting some massive plays. Ali and Fila actually played it in their, um, their show there just this week, um, which is available on YouTube and stuff as well. Um, but yeah, I'm wow. really excited. It's out on all platforms tomorrow. Um, B port, Spotify, iTunes, Apple Music, whatever, wherever you get your music. So uh, to do that, maybe uh, I'll try to find the link. Is it on pre-save right now? Would that be helpful? It's on pre-save. It'd, it'd be absolutely brilliant. Pre-save, you can pre-order also on B port. Uh, all right. Let's see if I can find the link. I don't have my Spotify open, or if we got anyone in the chat who might have be able to grab that for me, I can open my Spotify. And uh, how did you get connected with, uh, sorry, what did you say her name was, the 17 year old? Summer Moreland. Um, so ba right. basically I, I done a remix um, of a track that um, Summer had done the vocals on. I done that um, about eight or nine months ago and her, 
Our vocal was just incredible, so I, I reached out then and um, we put together Fire and Me. Um, Summer wrote the, the lyrics. Um, I obviously done the track, and um, it's, I'm just really, really happy with it. It's, it's turned out really good, and it's, it's getting some really great support at the moment as well. So we're both really excited for it to come out tomorrow, and hopefully it'll do well. I am just struggling to get the pre-save link. We can maybe we can pop that in our Discord. Yeah. Um, and Amir, to join our Discord, I'll actually pop the link in here, but it's discord.gg instead of .com uh, slash record shop. Ooh. And our chat is in the general chat. Uh, you know what? We can maybe have some of our friends here help you out. You might be stuck in our uh, verification. If you get to the verify and notification screen, there's a little icon that you had to click on the little like record shop icon and that'll get you into the main chat area. I am really enjoying this track. I'm curious to see the video. Hi there, it's Ali. Hi there, it's Oh, he said nobody's chatting in there. Let me get this plan. In three, with our first release, Eye of Horus, on Euphonic Records. For the following years, we built up our brand together, releasing on several labels, including a set of trance, sound piercing, bandit, and more. In 2009, we launched our own record label, Future Sound of Egypt, named after our weekly radio show, Under the Armada Umbrella. We have been able to showcase our own releases on our own record label, and in the process have received several accolades such as a State of Trans radio show Tune of the Year on four separate occasions. We have been voted several times into the DJ Mac Top 100 DJ poll and voted number one DJ on many occasions in various awards and polls. One of the pinnacle of our career was to host our future Sound of Egypt event at the Great Pyramids of Giza. We always try to strive to break the barriers with our music and stay true to our beliefs. Oh, I love that. Uh, and we were just saying it. One of your, you were saying one of your favorite reasons or your favorite things about FSOE is that not only is the music great, but the artists are great humans, which is what makes FSOE so special. It's a nice love that. Love that. All right. I am going to do uh, one last, when's the last time I've, through the uh, giveaway in there. I'm going to pop that in there one last time and then we're going to get ready to do some of the drawings for those giveaways. Uh, today we're going to give away three packs and I've got those six cards as well to give away. So you've got another like 30 seconds um, on that link that I just posted in the comments app.recordshop.com slash live to put your username and email or your name that we're going to display on screen because I'm literally going to draw uh, right now and your email address. Oh, perfect. Thank you. Reliquary. All right. Let's see who we're getting in here. I just want to make sure we've got kind of all those people. Amir, I do see you did it. Great. I want to make sure that everybody who's taking the time to chat with us is getting their, uh, chance to get their free packs. Uh, you can also pick up a free NFT, so it's absolutely free to you. Uh, I should bring that one up too and show you what is on that. Just give me a moment. I think actually I have that in my own collection, so I can share from there. Hmm, no, I can't. Okay. I don't know. What is up with me not being able to share stuff very easily today? It is a little frustrating. Not going to lie. All right. <laughs> so we can pick up UV absolutely free. Um, I will, maybe I can have some of my friends, uh, Leah or Reliquary or Eileen pop the link to the free NFT there in our comments so everybody can get that. All right, I'm gonna close up that form for the giveaways so that we can actually start doing the draws. And um, doo -doo -doo. didn't grab the right stuff. Just give me a moment while I get everybody in. We also, for those of you who are new, 
Um, we do some extra nice fun stuff for some of our fans. We call them OGAF. Uh, it stands for original gangsters as fuck who have been with Record Shop for uh, they've been with Record Shop for a while now, and they're they're super big supporters. So we try to do whatever we can. So they are all getting double entries into this draw. It just takes me like a half half a second to get it all together. All right, but UV you can get for free. Woo, that's quite that's quite the link that uh, Reliquary shared. <laughs> I think he's gonna put a better link in there if you just give him a moment. And I appreciate your help there, Chris. <laughs> there it is. So uh, there we go. All right, let me get my spin wheel ready. We will get some of our winners selected so we're giving away today three packs and we are going to give away uh all of those those six cards so maybe i'll do first the six cards um because you can win both a card and a pack but you can't but with the packs you can only win one pack all right let me get this shared da -da -da -da. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do. What should we do first? Let's do the cards first. I need, need my pen that I dropped on the floor earlier. All right, good luck to all of our folks who are in. I'm excited. So we're giving away um, Shadow, which I opened earlier. To looks like it's going to Greyhound. <laughs> Congratulations! All right. I'm going to remove you there and spin again. Next up is the card that I don't want to pronounce. <laughs> Not away. Rick Menninger. Congratulations. Next up is the pickup artist, the artifact card that I had got in my pack. Ooh, Leah, I think people would love to tell you how to become OGAF. Ocean, congratulations. <laughs> and hey, Rick, congratulations. I see you there in the comments. All right, next up is Fuel the Fire. Everybody, now, now that we've heard it, we really, really want to get it. Hey, yay, Chris, congratulations. Yeah. I feel like we need we need to wait to sign the cards since we have you here. It would have been nice to have a way to do that. <laughs> All right, who is next? Next is the one hour collectors mix that Ali and Fila put together. That looks like it's going to our girl Sonia. Congratulations! An hour of music is so so awesome. I'm excited for you. Congrats, Ocean. I see you in the comments there. And the last one of the six uh, collectibles that we're giving away is all about the melody. This is a collective. Congratulations. Yay. All right. Congratulations, everyone. Give me one moment, and I'm going to just re-put uh, everybody's name back in who I just took out because you are all still eligible for packs. I'm going to give that a little couple of shuffles all right three cards coming your way uh not cards three packs and i'll drop them to you right after the stream right after we log off oh i think i see where it's stopping hot safari <laughs> whoop, whoop. congratulations <laughs> Next up for another pack, Future Sound of Egypt. All of these can help you move towards that challenge we were talking about. Laura the Owl. I like that. You know, I got to love names when it includes an animal because mine is Redbird and I appreciate it. <laughs> All right. One more pack to give away. Congratulations, Laura, and Hot Safari. Ooh, Greyhound. 
How lucky are you today? The first person we drew and the last person we drew. Tuber Vision, you're a little late. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, congratulations, everyone. Yay, I'll drop those uh, right after this stream is over. Uh, I do want to kind of open up the floor, see if anybody does have any questions for uh, Harsky before we kind of finish up today, or if there's anything you want to say, because you've been a part of this the whole time. I feel like I've been talking a lot in the last 10 minutes. No, I'm happy enough about that. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> go, go to boss. It's okay. <laughs> I like it. Who is Obi still on? Did you hear that? I'm the boss. <laughs> just kidding. Um, all right. I'm going to just see who else is live right now and who we might want to go and listen to. I'm feeling like we want to keep up the trance vibes. Uh, I know Eileen and Reliquary always have good trance recommendations, but open to anything else. Greyhound, Lisa for president. Just shoot that one over to Obi. Make sure you at Obi when you say that next time. Uh, I know a state of trance is on, but I think they're in there 24 <laughs> seven. Everybody's funny in the chat here. Let's see, let's see. Got, I see some people with house music, but I'd like to keep the trance vibes going. Like I said, I need to do some heads down work this afternoon. So I need some music that I can just like absolutely zone in with. Any recommendations? CS code. Ooh, okay, okay. Vicious code. That makes way more sense. <laughs> All right. Let's do it. That is a good enough recommendation for me from our friend Reliquary. Um, everyone, thank you so, so much for being with us tonight. Uh, today, tonight for well, tonight for you. <laughs> yeah, it's nice um, now. Yeah, well, you got to get yourself a beer uh, to celebrate yes. your first your first NFT drop. Thanks for having me. It was an absolute Yay. Yeah, it, it's been so fun. Uh, I really appreciate getting to know you. Um, it's been fun to see some new names in the comments here too. Amir, we are really excited for you to join our community and to come chat with us in Discord. Uh, let's go check out. Uh, <laughs> let's go check out our friends over at Vicious Code. Cheers, everyone. Have a great night. Happy Cheers. drop Cheers. day. <laughs>